Hello, I bring you greetings from Florin United Methodist Church located in Sacramento, California. My name is Gail Chiu, pastor of Florin UMC. I came from a country in the far east and that country, Malaysia, is many, many miles away from here. And for the last 20 years, I have been traveling quite a bit between these two countries because now and then I miss my people back home. Due to traveling, I come across times that the flight aircraft was delayed. In the beginning, all passengers were told the delay would be a few hours. But there are times the delay is overnight. But one good thing about the airline companies, they make sure that all travelers are happy. So they put all the passengers onto a bus and then took us to good hotel and also with good food. We have a wonderful place to rest, to sleep, and also to have, to have our food. And the second day, we were brought back to the airport again and continue with our journey to our destination. No matter how wonderful one thing I come to realize, uh, the airline companies or the airport arrangement, how wonderful they may be. At the end, all the travelers or passengers got to leave the aircraft or the airport and go back to their respective destinations. Isn't that the same, very much the same, telling us about our lives? We may have a wonderful life on earth. We eat, we, we spend our life in such a way that we have a lot of enjoyment or we buy property here and there. We have good lives. But no matter how good lives may be or not that good, at the end of the day, all of us have to leave this planet earth have to say goodbye to this world and go to somewhere else. And that somewhere else is a place that is no longer on earth, but somewhere. Do you know where is that somewhere? Now we are in the season of Lent. A time that we remember the suffering and the passion of Jesus Christ, especially during the number of hours he was put on the cross. While he was on the cross, Jesus uttered one sentence to one of the robbers that were beside him, saying to the robber, Today you will be with me in paradise. Today you will be with me in paradise. Out of the two robbers, one was repentant and he saw the need that this person, well, Jesus Christ, he was not like him and his friend and he was innocent and yet he was placed on the cross and he was crucified to be, to, and ready to, to go to die. And he has this, he saw the needs of his own life and he felt that, yes, he need to repent and he asked Jesus, please remember me. And Jesus said, today you will be with me in paradise. This is a promise of Jesus. When the person saw the need to change, when a person sees that there is a need for him to come before the Lord 
and be transformed. He was given a chance. My friends, brothers and sisters in Christ, that speaks to all of us. That if we, if we have not come to the Lord, if we have not known His goodness and His mercy, now it's not too late. That we will all be given a chance, all will be granted a chance to receive Him as our Lord and Savior. Come to Him with a repentant heart and will be granted a place in His kingdom. Amen. Hello, family and friends. Greetings from Florin United Methodist Church in Sacramento, California. Tune in every Monday at 12.30 for our devotionals. We thank you very much for watching them each week. Thank you for subscribing to this channel also. If you're not subscribed, please click the subscribe button, push notification bells, and like and leave a comment on our weekly devotionals. Once again, thank you very much. Have a blessed day. Stay safe, wear your mask, stay six feet apart, and God's blessings to you.